And we're back on Southeast Texas Weekly. Won't you help welcome Joe Evans, the vice chair of the GOP in Jefferson County with us. Don Brown uh, with the uh, a former congressional candidate in the 14th congressional district. And the broadcasting legend, my great friend Jack Piper, here to talk. Hey, ho! Talk, talk uh, with us. Well, it's great to have you, man. <laughs> talk. I've been a huge fan. Been talk. I've oh. been a huge fan for so long, <laughs> man. Well, let's talk about this matter. That, and we'll go back to a subject we've already been on a while, but it seems still fresh and interesting. This matter of Hillary Clinton and the email rollout. To me, and I didn't get to address this in the last segment. To me, it's more the question of these emails sort of rolling out over the course of time uh, that every couple of weeks, and our good friend Michael Lindsay would assert that it, it, this rollout over time, there will, there will be no sm uh, smoking gun in any of the emails, so it doesn't matter whether they roll out every, every 30 days. Who on this panel believes it's altogether possible there will be additional information come out every couple of uh, months where we do see a, some kind of a smoking gun that... Uh, her critics on the right will uh, exploit. Don Brown? Kevin, here's the thing. If they were to dump everything at one time, the right would be complaining that they dumped everything at and one time. And then, according to Machiavellian political theory, it would all be over with and we would just go on. Except for then there would be a year of investigations from, from our Senate on why it was that they dumped all that information at one time instead of actually putting it into consumable bite-sized churches. Well, she's got one more committee appearance. Mm -hmm. To me, this is... She's promised to a show more, up. Uh, it doesn't really impact, I think, on what you and I are thinking out there as far as issues uh, are concerned. Uh, uh, it, it just takes uh, the, 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 the focus away from what they ought to be talking about. There you go. Uh, Absolutely. That's, that's, that's the way I feel. You're, you're, you're asserting the you case that we're thinking about our gas prices, and we're thinking about the economy, and we, we don't give a darn about what happens. Gas prices, back. jobs, what's happening to this country? Our infrastructure is dying in America. We're doing nothing about it. Uh -huh. Instead, we're still spending money everywhere in the world Except in America. Congressman right. Babin made that precise point just uh, days he ago. He, he sure did. Oh, you must have seen that on 12 News. Well, in regards to, to the Hillary emails. <laughs> so we're going to steer back to that well, anyway, no, even though we've all just said well, how anyway, irrelevant In regards to the Hillary emails, <laughs> I did some Joe traveling. has bring a chance yeah, away. Yeah, yeah. I did some traveling, and that means a lot to us in Texas. But the rest of the country and voters don't Hillary really pay attention said, to it. Hillary said, what difference at this point does it make? What happened in Benghazi? That's the, that's the attitude of the, re the rest of the general well, voters. Well, actually, actually, it should be everybody should feel that way because what really matters is that people died. They died because our Congress, because our government voted to instead of giving the, the Secretary of State the funds that she needed to oh, properly no. protect uh, the, the, the embassies, we cut because that's what the Republican Party said was important was tax cuts, and instead we left the we left our our so embassies so unprotected so and underfunded. Back, back on Hillary, Hillary. Fault. Jack. <laughs> I said something <laughs> which once yes, which made was. sense. No. Just tell the truth. Anybody the American Joe. people Hillary's are the most forgiving people in the world. Uh. If you made a mistake. And we make mistakes. But she you didn't. Make them she, she didn't very rarely. But she she would not. She 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 re refused to come and testify right. for the longest time. So, but, but on what? On what? The the every well, the, the Republican the the, the, the Republican co committees have the controlled committees have all said the same thing. They have found no malfeasance they have found no errors that the secretary of state made when? so I, I they have that, that, that was that. actually yeah, that back in october video, the answer is Florida? last october I'd say that the, was the, the select story. committee the select think, committee on benghazi actually in months uh, uh, there's a, there, because they there had, their committees have all said the same thing the committees the select committee on benghazi's ruling was is that there they found why, nothing that, why did Hillary that they not release the emails right away? The, the emails why did she have not release there's the emails national right away? security at a, in effect on some of those things. Her private and stuff, her, you mean and stuff the private like stuff is none of our business. <laughs> but, but, but she was during the time that she worked for the State it Department. Doesn't State Department. Careful, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Careful. It, and We're other, entitled to see it by law. Right. No, you're no, not. In terms of this actually, issue. no, you're not That's allowed to see it. Actually, it's not. The regulations that were installed. Because for for political expediency, 
I I I All right, let me do this quickly. I just have 30 seconds, I believe it is. What wow. do we think, guys, about uh, the, the, the momentum in the GOP primary? We've talked about the Democrats a lot already. What do we think about who's gaining traction? Who's getting momentum on the GOP side of, uh, of things here in the presidential the party, race? The party's gaining momentum. The party's gaining yes, momentum. Yes, an active primary The Republican wonders. tells us this. Whoever is building clown cars wonders. for the GOP president. Yes. Yes. I think an active six primary does wonders for, for, for the party. It gets people moving, it gets people and who loud. what's next? I, I can say who's losing, and that's the American people, because yeah. because they're not actually discussing things, again, yeah. as he was Democrats saying, that are, are important, they get Hillary that are important to the people. Instead, we're talking about divis divisive issues instead. And I've one, one there, more thing, and nobody mentioned this. Uh, there is a spot called the vice presidency. Mm -hmm. Some of these folks are getting into this because they figure they'll make enough name to be BP. rock the boat enough. Rick Santorum Rick jumps Santorum out this week. That uh, they could be a vice presidential nominee. Is, Rand, is, Paul, is Rand a, Paul, though, Rand Paul at least has the courage enough to stand up and say that the war that we got into was bad, was wrong, and we need to get out wrong. of it. He's wrong. We need to get out of Rand it. Rand Paul's wrong. We could start a whole Rand new Paul discussion. Rand Paul is Kevin, courageous for that. Mm -hmm. Rand Paul's wrong. The timid James Shannon returns in just moments here on Southeast Texas Weekly to give us his, hopefully, give us his views, although we, I will have to pull it out of him. When we come back, stay with us.